hello good day and welcome to about device today we are going to be learning how to convert a disk from mbr to gpt using co the command prompt and also the windows PowerShell. remember that when converting all your data on the disk will be lost the tutorial will be created on how to use the software to prevent data from being lost when converting from gpt to mbr so first of all to convert from um, MBR to GPT. First of all, go to the command prompt in the start menu. Click on the start menu, then search for command prompt. You need to launch the command prompt as administrator. So, run as administrator, you accept the administrative privilege. Now, there are rules that you, um, you write in the command prompt. This will be placed in the description below. I'll place it in the description. So all you have to do is what begin. So the first is what dix part. So after creating the dix part, you need to list your dix. So first of all, you need to go to my computer, that is this PC, and check which dix do I want to convert from MBR to G GPT. You could see that the size of mine is what 120 gig, 119 gig. So I come back here. 119 gig that is what the dix2 so you need to what select dix2 depending on the dix number if it's dix1 you select dix1 if you for my dix2 so i select this two so next you clean it so after cleaning it you now convert convert gpt and that's all it will be converted and you could see that the dix have been successfully converted so we now exit now the next i'll be guiding you how to use the windows PowerShell. so you go to the start menu right click on it then click on windows PowerShell admin you run it as administrator expand it the same rules start for disk parts you list your disk you select disk which is the dix i want to use here you clean it then you convert gpt and it has been successfully converted also mount it then i'll exit this now if you go to go back to the c drive or your pc you find out that the dix is not shown so in order to show the dix use right click on the start menu go to dix management so you expand this then you go to dix management you can see that it's unallocated all you have to do is what create a new simple volume then assign it you could perform a quick format if you feel you want to all right and this will create the dig so thanks for watching this tutorial hope you've learned how to convert from mbr to gpt please like share and comment below for any issue face thank you